Anyway. Hey. hey everybody, welcome to the stream. Ooh. Oh god, I gotta shoot you now. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh no. Why would you yeah. ooh woo? It's because so it's the most cringe. ironic thing in the world. What the hell? Why am I signed out of RPG sessions? I didn't what do it. it. I don't know. What what the mean? Fuck? Did you get uh, the HTTP uh failure error? No, it just isn't signing me in. I've had that yeah, problem had before. That. Yeah, I've had that happen too. Oh, uh, here we go. It just took three times. That's okay. Uh, Brady, this is book two, chapter 10. Are we going into chapter 10? Or are we starting yes. a new book? Uh, yes, we are. Sorry. I I definitely got it away from me because I used to update the chapters um, and then I stopped doing that. Oh, you're um, fine. I'm just curious. I'm looking at so because I keep it in my notes. Three? Or is this book two? Yeah. This is. You know what? This is the beginning of book three. Oh, and, book three, and, chapter one. Hey, I also like that because the first book was also nine chapters. So I just wanted to. Right. Now I that for my. You know, anal retentiveness here. And this chapter will be called the negotiation. Oh, oh, uh oh. Hey, we had one of those. <laughs> you chapter, did. I... Book two, it chapter was seven was sister. the negotiation. Negotiation <laughs> part two. The part two. The negotiations continue. I love it. I love it. Um, right. Would people like a quick recap of uh, where we left off? Yes, I would. Yes. I wouldn't say no to a recap. Yes, That'd be nice. a recap would be good because for some reason the. Uh... So, 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 something did fuck up, and I'm fixing it. Oh, no. Take your time. Oh, no. Take your time. Wait, Do you need me to pause for a second? Session. No, no, it's good. It's good. I just, it's the, uh, it's the RPG session, uh, view so that you got, so that people can see the dice roll and the characters. Oh, okay. I'm assuming oh. we aren't, we all have a past green die for some reason. Yes, yeah, so that was from Augment. Yep. I'm assuming remember... we are not augmented anymore. I remember being augmented. We we should still be because it was only like an. Well, it well was that, that, like... that encounter ended. Yeah, which means okay. that augment yeah. ends. Yep, yep, yep. Um, and I'm looking at the table here, and it looks like we didn't roll for a uh, strain recovery at the end of that encounter. I thought we did because I only have one strain. Yeah, and Car um, only has the one strain. It. Resilience. Well, I think that oh, was yeah. the frostbite. No, yeah, I don't see any. No, no one rolled. No one yeah, strain recovery. One of us didn't have strain after that. Kaye had wounds. Yeah. Well, let's see if I get rid of it. Ah, uh, HTTP failure. My favorite. <laughs> Thank you, <laughs> RPG sessions. Ah, uh, yes. To upgrade my fucking. And it player. signed me out. You'll love to see it. You really do. Oh. Oh. Oh man. Jenny, your hair is looking fire today. Thank you. I need to touch up my roots. But I'm loving the pink. Yeah, the pink turned out really nice. Right? And I think wait, from this, wait. we'll eventually transition to blonde for the summer. Oh, Ooh, that's nice. Is, you know, yeah, while, that way while, I can go swimming while, and not worry about it. While we wait for a little bit and for me to shamelessly oh. plug, have you guys oh. been keeping up with my other streams? I have not. Man. I have not. I've been so, so busy. I'm Rick sorry. doesn't actually have other streams. He's just lying to you. I all. get the notifications. No, no I, get, I, get I get them all the time. And every time I get them, I'm like, I'm like, ah, oh, I'm not like, I can't watch this right now. I'm sorry. I get yes. that. <laughs> well, currently, I have two two series going on right now. We have Here Be Dragons, which just started last week, and the first episode is currently up, and nice, is nice. currently my most viewed video. Ever? Awesome. Ever, yes. Wow. It might... uh, is this on Twitch or is this on YouTube? You, it's on YouTube. I stream on Twitch. As you stream on Twitch, okay. And I put it up on YouTube at, at Hunter Plays. Um, the uh, and anyway, but Here Be Dragons just went up and it's currently doing really well. Yeah, as well as nice. Tales of the Fairy Queen, which is currently in its 
quote unquote second season. I like to call it the second season. Uh, and that is cur and that is the game that I actually play Saturdays in the evenings in the stream. Yeah, oh, just... well, I wasn't even subscribed on YouTube, but now I am. YouTube's easier to share the links to. Yeah. Yeah. Um, folks, ready for the session recap? Sure am. Yep. All right. So last session, uh, saw the party uh, almost to come to Frostbite. Yeah. Um. You traveled to the uh, Northern Water Tribe, and with it, you faced a mighty storm in which we had one of our fellow party members fall over into the water mm. and was almost <laughs> lost to the icy abyss. Uh, from that? there... <laughs> what, sorry? I don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> Ozzy fell overboard. That? Okay. Um... And with that, you were able to successfully navigate your way to the Northern Water Tribe, where you met um, Asia's, not Asia, sorry, uh, Avari's uncle, uh, who greeted you all um, as the chieftain of the Water Tribe. And that is where we left things off. So you have just entered the Northern Water Tribe's uh, domain. Um, if you remember from Avatar, the first season, they've lowered, what was that, sorry? Huh? Oh, I, I think I got feedback fine. on myself. Uh, oh, <laughs> you asked yourself a question. <laughs> I did. I did ask myself a question. Um, so with it, you are now in the Northern Water Tribe. Your ship has now docked. You have a small contingent of Water Tribes persons uh, waiting for you, including the chieftain of the Water Tribe, which, Jenny, I will let you, uh, since he's your uncle, you can come up with his name. I just pulled up Avari's um, sheet. Do you have it open on Drive? Uh, not right now, but give me one second and I can. Okay. Because we didn't name a lot of people. Just posting some, some mood art of the Northern Water Tribe. Uh, yes. It sucks because like most of the stills from the actual show are really small. Like This is just so small. Mm -hmm. But boy, is there some good art out there? Oh. Um. So wait, we're we're walking up to my uncle, or is he approaching us? What's going on? So he is waiting with a small contingent of uh, waterbenders um, uh, at the end of the dock area, and they are okay. waiting specially uh, at you. He did. Uh, uh, has seen you um, from the ship, and he's beaming with a bright smile. Oh my god! Avari, who is this man? Oh, that, 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 that's my that's my uncle. Um, hi, and she's just gonna wave. Um, you're gonna notice that her uncle is very tall, uh, more of a slender build though. Um, he's got the long whitish hair he's definitely showing his age um but looks well kept like he's kind of proud of how long he's been alive um mm -hmm. very simple but regal attire um form-fitting blue with the furs and um mm -hmm. there goes the song in my head yeah <laughs> blue with the fur <laughs> <laughs> the whole club was just um, better. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Um, oh, automation looking at her. <laughs> um, no, he's. I think you can tell by Avari's reaction. Also, he's the one who encouraged her more impulsive side. So, like, she's excited to see him, and apparently, he's excited that she's back. That's awesome. Um, as uh, you you do that, Azia. Looks over the uh, village and says, It has been a long time since I've seen proper water bent architecture. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, it just reminds me of 
Is it all ice? Yes, it's all. Or less, I mean, occasionally, okay. maybe like a fish gets frozen in it, but like it's not on purpose. How do you stay warm? Am I that? to go to bed in this? And I, you know, gesture to my parka. But yes. we'll get you all set up. We'll get you some nice furs. We'll get you some blankets, maybe a cloak, whatever you need. It. You, I mean, I don't think it's that cold. I'm comfortable. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yes, uh, the infamous... This, oh, this is shorts weather. <laughs> <laughs> this is what? what? Shorts, shorts weather. weather. Um, yeah, it really is. It's not uh, even that cold out. As Azia licks it, Tyrion says this. You would be surprised at how insulative ice can be. Uh, yeah, I would be very surprised. <laughs> Everyone has Meanwhile, lived in a cold climate. Like, super bundled up, but like, just like shivering, like, like you could hear teeth chattering. <laughs> <laughs> um, imbecile, I'm adding names on the Google Drive to make your life easier. Perfect. Would you mind resharing me that link just so that I have it fresh? Oh my god. I know. I know. Yeah, it's so... It's a thing. Everything's a process. Alright, let me shoot it to you in a private message. Hmm. It just... Oh, look at the two private messages. Ooh. 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 A scandal. You should oh. see our private messages. The, I just, it's so, the North Water Tribe capital, Agnikala, is so pretty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It really uh, is. Kaye, I will say that for you, you feel very strange as you can't feel any earth right now. Oh, you know, that is a problem. Yeah, that makes sense. And also, <laughs> I feel like kind of recovering from that, like, frostbite or whatever state of frozenness that I, I had on our adventure here. So I suffer how many strain? Or just flavor-wise I suffer strain? Uh, it's just say that last bit again, sorry. I said do I, like, how many strain do you actually want me to suffer? I think um, we you already had... dealt all that. Yeah, we already dealt with all of that. Oh, okay. I just didn't so, know. No, I mean, sense <laughs> no you're good you're good um so perfect jenny i appreciate you sharing that doc yep and you um, say i'm filling it in as quickly as humanly possible I like the collar too. is it yamak i think that's how you say it i'll leave it up to you okay um the chieftain uh goes forward and sees uh avari and uh Let's his rather regal demeanor slip for a second as he extends his arm out for a hug from his favorite niece. And she jumps into his arms and is just, there's a weight lifted off of her and she squeezes him and she lets him like lift her up. I miss you so much. Sweet niece, you've been gone for so long. How has the world been to you? Has it been kind? It has been enlightening. A most interesting answer. Yeah, I <laughs> assume Ozzy and Karu are next down the ramp, and they uh, once Ozzy gets to the bottom, she will uh, give a martial arts bow to the chief. He raises an eyebrow at that and uh, looks at uh, Asia, uh and says, well, hello there. Are you a friend of my niece's? I have been. So the answer much... is yes. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, well, here's the thing. Asia always has to make things complex because that's who she is. I am one hundred percent. Kiki said that. Oh my god. The answer is yes. <laughs> it really is. Asia has um helped me with my impulse control. I have been somewhat of a and I over. I, I fear to say, I think I've been a burden on her this trip. A burden 
is something that we must accept. And she just smiles after saying that. Because, mm -hmm. of course, she's going to be the, uh... Is it not? Teen mom. Yeah. Teen mom. Teen mom. Uh, and also, she's going to be somewhat cryptic. Somewhat. Basically, yeah. she's saying that even if you are a burden, it is my choice to carry you. Mm-hmm. And then um, I think Avari is going to pull Karu front and center and be like, and this, this is Karu, and he's not really good with people, but he is, like, really good at protecting me and um, not letting me walk into traps. And, yeah. Karu just looks extremely <laughs> uncomfortable. <laughs> what? Honestly, I don't even know what Karu uncomfortable looks like versus like Karu comfortable because there's no. You've such never thing seen Karu comfortable. <laughs> Good point. Uh, I think the closest was the bathhouse episode. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Uh, Azia will will uh, put a hand on Avari's shoulder and says, this. "Let him introduce himself at his own pace." And we'll be here forever. And then um, Chief Dean Yamak uh, looks at him and says, Greetings, it is nice to have a fellow water tribesman here, especially from the southern tribe. Why especially? It has been many moons since we have seen a member of the southern tribe here. Mm -hmm. And then who are these two? And he looks over at Kaye and uh, Tareem. Or Gilliman. She's going to just like wave them forward because now she knows that she's not supposed to be introducing and is supposed to be letting them. Come on, guys, say hi! Through her teeth and still like holding herself as like tightly as she can. She'll kind of like, you know, she's holding herself but just her hand is extended. Forward to be like, uh, uh, hi. <laughs> uh, Seeing her shivering, uh, Chieftain Yamak or Yamak says, Yamak? Yeah, Yamak. Sorry. Yamak. Yeah, no, Yamak. That's Yamak. Y A M O K. Is that what you said? Y A M A. I literally just copy pasted names from the Water Tribe website. I Thanks. love this, Yamak. Okay. Um, he says, get this poor woman some uh, furs. And maybe maybe some hot tea. She could really use some hot tea. Yes, that too. Uh, my my eyebrow perks up at the mention of hot tea. Uh, and I look from Avari to the chief, and I simply say, hello. And he's like, greetings. And where do you hail from, stranger? I come from the desert. I've never seen a desert dweller. And with that, he like checks you out and like looks over at your wrappings um, and seeing that your face is covered. This is the most interesting attire that you have on. Yes, uh, the desert is much like this, but made of rock and sand. And not ice and snow. Uh, and she's going to like glance at Tareem and decide to go with a more formal approach. That's, Tareem has b taught me patience. And he has been a great ally. And it is through the benefit of knowing his sister who I imagine is still on the ship getting the manifest ready that we are able to enter into trade negotiations um, with the people of the Earth Kingdom 
<laughs> we do not speak for the Earth Kingdom, Avari. My sister is not. We are not a part of that. I Don't mean, speak. she's literally an emissary. Yes, but she speaks on behalf of the Bayform. Bayforms are part of the... I don't know how it works. The Bayforms basically own the uh, Earth Kingdom. <laughs> yeah, aren't they, like, richer than Boomy? Yeah, they are. <laughs> <laughs> it depends, because the Earth Kingdom really is multiple nations. That's true. That's true. Um, with that, um, the chief in looks at his trade relations with the Earth Kingdom, I... I'm quite frankly shocked that during the midst of this war, uh, there would be an attempt to uh, further trade, but... Well, we, we, we must keep our pathways open, and having allies in a time like this where no one is coming to save us, I think we need to forge these alliances. At which point, Asya will also speak and say, yes, the Fire Nation. As myself and Karu have learned from personal experience over the years, and our friends have learned as well over the course of our adventures, is quite relentless. They, if we allow them to break the bond between us, they do not stand a, do not stand a chance against their onslaught. It is like. Letting the letting the dikes crumble in order to let them look pretty, if you will. With that, um, the chieftain looks at you and says, "Wise words from a stranger." Looking at Avari, he says. Negotiations can commence, but first, let us throw you a welcome feast for you and your friends. Okay. Um, I, I, I should show them my... Oh, God, they have to meet my parents. You know... Mom's not around, is she? <laughs> <laughs> can, can people go anywhere in the Northern Water Tribe? That is the question. Yeah, he's not allow you to have pretty free reign. Yeah, but like I think I think I'm just asking like if Mom's not around, where would she have gone? <laughs> well, like is she working or is she like does she know that I'm here? I think is is the point of that. You see your mother um, near the uh, back of the contingent, uh, no! along with your, along with your father, and she's looking at you and your friends with a scowl on her face. No, oh, I'm in trouble. I oh. hope your mom embarrasses you as much as my mom embarrassed me. <laughs> oh, you have no idea. Is that woman a threat, Avari? Yes! And she uh, should be I taken out! out. Uh, uh, and I start walking uh, toward Ozzy, her. Ozzy, 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 it's my mom! It's my mom! It's my mom! <laughs> yeah, Ozzy, Ozzy grabs her the moment he starts reaching for the knife and says, <laughs> Not? No. No. Don't you see the resemblance? That look. Does she look like Avari? Yeah, Avari is very much a miniature version of her mother, but she has her father's um like cheekbones and eye structure. This would not be the first time I killed someone's parents. I mean, maybe wait till we're out of sight and then I'll talk to you. Let's just let's go make nice, okay? Let's let's go make nice. And you guys are going to pretend that I have been nothing but professional on this entire trip. Hey, Tareem. God damn. I'm now going to have to put Tareem on a leash. This is the new one. All right. Wild card. <laughs> All right. Ugh. So uh, with that, um, your mother coldly greets you and says, hello, daughter. Oh, my hey, God. Mom. Oh, my God. 
pulls out the knife again. She's yeah. a threat. <laughs> you feel that the uh, ice around you is somehow warmer than the expression coming from Avaria's mother. I missed you. Uh, and I miss you in the healer's huts. We were remiss without you. Well, you see, I, I've been learning new ways to heal because there's always room for improvement. And you told me that my healing could really use some improvement. So I I went out oh, for right. some practical study. Azia will uh, put her hand, like she's standing behind Avari, like completely will put her hands on Avari's shoulder and say, take a deep breath and remain calm. Right. Your village is healer. I am glad to share what I have learned with you and the other healers as I do aspire to one day assume your mantle. Lofty aspirations from one who would leap. And Uncle oh, Yannick uh, said I could, okay? At which point, As Asya will uh, step in front of Avari and say, "Is You may say that, but if one does not expand their knowledge and remain secular, the knowledge starts to deteriorate and become tradition and habit. When those habits the forms, mistakes are made. At the mention of the word tradition, Avari's mother says, tradition is everything. Tradition are answers to problems we forgot. And when we forget the problems, we lose the tradition. Kari is actually going to gonna step forward now. And kind of, kind of still looking pretty uncomfortable but he's gonna he's gonna start talking to uh Vari's mother and say and besides that tradition doesn't matter when the fire nation is burning down your home you haven't experienced that because you have these great big walls but they'll get through eventually perhaps not regardless it is time for us to treat you as hosts and uh, give you all uh, the ceremonial tea and uh, have oh, you there's all... There's a lot of tea. There's a lot of tea being spilt right now. There is so oh. much tea. No, Where's dad? Spilt tea. Your dad is um, uh, walking up, uh, more like power walking up, to be honest with you. Uh, well, Mom, he... it's been real. Uh, love you. Bye. And she's just going to dart off to her dad. Um, and your dad uh, says, I'm sorry, and then gives you a big bear hug. Hi, Daddy! I'm just being mean. Oh my god, of oh. course she's a fucking daddy's girl. Yeah, are you surprised? <laughs> <laughs> With that, um, your father, the general of the Northern Water Tribe, uh, says, ah, oh, it has been quite some time that we've gone off on an adventure together, my daughter. But it seems I, like you've found adventure on your own. I did, I did. And I even, and she's going to wave power over specifically. I, I did the, the, the... Guys, what was it called? The thing that we did with the rocks? Oh, oh I forget okay. what it's called. Uh, it was the... Um, it was the... Is the sand plate? sailing? The, the yeah, sand, we did sand sailing, but it's um, it's a specific tradition in the Southern Water Tribe. It was yeah, I think, it was was it glacier ice dodging? dodging. Was that, ice dodging. Ice dodging. Ice dodging. Yeah. yeah. Yes. I, I even I even I even um, this young man was successful in um, ice dodging in a desert. In a desert, you say? What in a most desert. interesting story. Dad, there was sand everywhere, and I was, like, clinging to the railing, 
and it was and bubbles on one scale. Where is bubbles? Uh, what is might, a bubbles? Bubbles might be hibernating. Uh, yeah, I think he's asleep on the ship. I mean, you'll, you'll meet you'll meet bubbles later. He's 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 my friend. He's he's an, another animal that I found. Bubbles did not want to leave the ship. I don't blame him. Bubbles. I did not want to leave the ship. I don't blame you. About that tea. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, yes. can, can we the, the 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 guest chambers in our home? Yes, we'd be most happy to have you uh, come to our home and warm you up with some tea. And with that, um, you all quickly make your way to Avari's home, which is uh, really like a small palace. It's not much. I'm sorry, guys, but I think there's enough for everyone to have their own room. And with that, you Ari have... just stares on, like, what do you mean? It's not much. <laughs> Jaw is, like, practically in the snow. With that, you all gather together in a ceremonial circle where you have a uh, water tribes a man who has a significant burn across his face, um, forming a zigzag across, serve you the ceremonial tea. Who will be having some tea? Um, my, my Hyatt, Hyatt's hand, like, Hyatt hasn't moved much, but this time her hand just, like, very quickly straight to the air. <laughs> Me. Uh, Azia will, uh, will say, I will partake in some tea as well. And then she will uh, lean over to Kaya and says, if you are cold, you can take my hand. Oh. Yeah, Here. Mama Asia. Uh, and she does whisper this. She doesn't want to reveal she's a firebender in the middle of the uh, Northern Water Tribe. That might turn out really bad. Might not be a good oh, idea. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Um, Tareem will, will take any tea that is offered to him. Mm -hmm. And Avari will oh. wait until her guests are served before she Literally, he does not sit down in whatever, like, wherever we are. Uh, he's like standing near an entrance, but eyes on Avari. Avari will wait for everyone else because it, it it. Please help yourselves. I, as hostess, will wait until you all are sated, and then I will help myself. So with with that, um, I'm going to need everyone to make. A four purple difficulty vigilance check. What? Vigilance. Uh, is there anyone in the party that has uh, what is it, heightened awareness? Uh, I believe I do. Let me double check. Um, uh, do I need to make a bit? Everyone who has E or everyone, everyone? Boost. Everyone, everyone. No, I don't have it. Okay. I was wondering if Pengu had it, is why I was. <laughs> nah, he doesn't have it either. Damn. Because uh, at, oh, like, at, like every time in like every game I've been in, someone who has a pet, the pet has heightened awareness because animals are just generally more aware. Sure, mm -hmm. sure. All right, Avari. Oh, you got a lot of threat though. I mean, you know, may I met Avari? May I may I have a boost die on this check because I have uh, an animal companion, Pengu, who is generally more aware than I am of situations. Sure. Do we Excellent. have that that additional ability die still? Is that a thing? No, that's no. Not. Uh, no. Okay. Currently, I'm not lightning doubt. For vigilance, I want to roll in real life, but I'll let just do it here for the sake of. Whoa! Oh, Pengu is asleep. Pengu uh, said it. Pengu's hibernating. G at least is... one of us succeeded. All right, so yeah, the one who did it Avari, need to. Uh -huh. Avari succeeded and Asia <laughs> succeeded. All right, Asia, you notice that um, your tea uh, seems perfectly fine. Um, uh, Avari, with the threat, uh, you since you weren't actually uh, consuming the tea. Or rather, watching everyone get served the tea. You he has bad manners to go first. 
you happen to notice that the um, server of the T seems particularly nervous. Well, maybe he's new. Uh, but with the threat, I'm going to say you're not quite sure why. Okay. Um, and then, so you'll see that, and then I presume you all will be drinking said tea. I'm going to hold off for a, for a second, and I'm also going to shift Karu a look. Get but I will wait. I not drink the tea either. He was, I wasn't intending to, uh, or, or Tareem wasn't. Tea. My tea. is already on her second. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a second. I'll try to sniff it. Hi, I need you to make a. You're on your second tea, you said? Oh, boy. Yeah. <laughs> I need you to make a five purple resilience check. Oh, my God. Oh, it probably That's would have only rough. been hard if it wasn't for the multiple. And I'm going to flip a story point to upgrade it once. Oh, man. Oh, no. Jesus it. Christ. Yes. You're I'm dead. a bad host. <laughs> resilience, too. So this is going to be really fun. I'm never going to have friends over again. You said two green? Yeah, yes. that's my resilience. Oh, man. All right. Um, With the threat, you just you slurp down the tea, and you think it tastes great. Listen. That's a threat? Because <laughs> it's, it's probably poisoned. <laughs> it's probably drugged, not poisoned. Aww. Poison is a, I mean, what is a drug but poison for your body? Well, the 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 effects are different. Ah, uh, well, the the thing is, at the end of the day, it is the the liquid that is being poisoned. This the is effect fine. Of this it is fine. Work. Everything's fine. It's oh, fine. It's not. It's really not. It's really not. <laughs> no, no, it's fine. Maybe, maybe it's just it tastes bad. No, no it actually, great. they crushed up eight ambiens and threw it in the tea. Oh god, that sounds like a that sounds like a weekend. <laughs> Kiki's just stuffing her face with any like I don't know, there's like cookies or biscuits or something like that, and she's just like guzzling down. She's like, this is great. Do I recognize of, this server? Is he someone new since I've been gone? He um uh is someone that you actually know quite a bit about. He was um uh attacked by Someone named Hotfoot. Oh, many oh, years ago. Oh, oh, oh. The fuck? Um, and uh, ever since then, he has um, avoided traveling in the Earth Kingdom. He traveled in his uh, youth, uh, but since then um, has been a bit of a homebody. Oh, are we getting racially profiled? I think so. Which kind of fits with how you guys met Avari. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah, after a minute, Asya will, uh, if a, a minute has passed and Kaye hasn't fallen asleep, then Asya will drink. Yeah, um, she looks perfectly fine. Yeah. Yeah. Asya will cautiously drink because Asya is. Uh, upon seeing that she's perfectly fine. And yeah, she, you... Oh, sorry. And that you were making her roll to fucking make us paranoid. I would never do such a thing. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna have some tea, too. Um, I'll have, I'll have, I'll have a cup. Um, so, <laughs> so it seems like, um... So let's see here. Uh, Benji. We're having Avari is having some tea. Uh, Asia is having some tea. Anyone else having tea? Um, can I try to like bend the tea and see if there's something else in there? Yeah, whose tea are you bending? My own. <laughs> Basically, he's just he's stirring it around. 
Yeah, um, you know what? It's just tea with some um, residue with some leaves in the bottom of it. Um, it seems to be made entirely of just hot water and uh, some tea leaves. Then yeah, I'll, I'll drink it. I mean, it's probably it's fine. fine. It's fine. I just take another long it's sniff. Um, I think it's fine. You can pour third glass. Tareem, since you're sniffing it, um, your third glass. <laughs> I need Tareem. I need you to make a hard resilience check. Oh no! As the fumes from the tea enter your nostrils. Oh shit! Why am I not good at resilience? What the hell? I What's wrong thought... with Earth Kingdom people? They're nice. I would have thought that I was resilient. Well, yeah, it's I know it's because it's brawn. Yeah, it's brawn. Yeah, I know I'm small, but like I would have thought the skill. Even. Right, I would have thought that you oh, were I'm a grants in the skill. Well, I'm a bounty hunter. They don't. They're not intrinsically resilient. That's fine. Well, you said it was hard. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three, and you do have three story points. Yeah, I'm gonna use one uh, to say that uh, Tareem has has been around teas before, so he knows what he's looking for, or he thinks he does. Around tea. This, this, this. He's an assassin hunter. bounty hunter. Like this is he. He's definitely he's encountered boy. tea before. I'm definitely. Oh tea. no. A, a flat, escalate. Escalate. A flat escalate. Uh, if you want to uh, escalate, you can. Uh, remind me again. Upgrade both sides. Uh, roll again. Yeah. Upgrade both sides. Roll again. Yep. Yep. Uh, sweet. Okay. I I oh. guess I'll do that. Does that include the the upgrade that I yes. spent the yes. story point on? Yep. Yep. It includes your original dice pool. Okay. So one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. Uh, no, <laughs> not three. <laughs> Guys, I am sweating. Oh, oh, oh no, that is <laughs> that's worse. That's worse. I should just no successes I... is. Oh. What? Oh. Um, the tea smells perfectly normal to you, um, and I will bank that threat as part of things that will happen later uh, in the day. Oh, okay. Well, uh, I'll take a sip. Freddy's yeah. just giggling to himself right now. He's like, you know what? Why? Um, why is Avari the one that's stressed out the most about this? Well, I'm seeing the rolls. <laughs> this is Jenny stressed out, not Avari stressed out. <laughs> Avari oh. is happily drinking her tea and just like prattling off about their adventures. And who's with us right now? Is it just us? It's just us. I think mom and dad are probably off talking to my aunt and uncle. And, I don't know where my uh, brothers are, but we don't need them. And they're talking to Shereen's sister as well. Hmm. Hmm. Um, but yeah, the only person that you have really interacted with in here in this uh, tea room has been um, that server. Mm -hmm. You know what it is? It's probably that something to do with with people that, with water tribes and tea. That's probably what the check is. That's why it's why uh, Asia hasn't need, needed to make it because she grew up in a water tribe. That's true. As as Tareem, you know, looks around the room, looks at the people in the room, it's it's just our party and the server. He will eventually looks at the server. Does the server look out of place? Like, does he look noticeably non-Water Tribe? Um, he No, he very much is full of Water Tribe regalia. He's got his uh, blue furs on uh, and the like, um, bright okay. blue eyes. Uh, so he very much looks the part of a uh, Water Tribes person. You said he has a significant burn on his face. That's right. Mm -hmm. Right. It kind of looks like if you were to take a pot of water and throw it on someone's face um, and the water would be spread out, that's what the burn looks like. So it's like scattered across his face. I see. Okay. Um, above the table, what happened was he got attacked by Hotfoot and he basically had flecks of lava um, hit his face. Oh, yeah. That, that sucks. Yeah. Cool scar, though. Yeah, cool scar. He should have flipped the story point to make it look like a butterfly. 
And then no. it would stung like a bee. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh. No. Avari is very much just in her element. Because she can't see dice rolls because she is a character and is just happy to be home. Yeah, this is yeah. a pretty decent tea, Avari. Right? I mean, it's not, it's not my personal brew, but I'm not allowed to make that anymore because apparently the herbs I used are expensive. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, but it's, it's really thought, good to help you sleep. I thought you people didn't care about expenses. Don't you get dividends? <laughs> when the herbs I'm using are from mom's personal store, I get in trouble. It seems like you get in quite a bit of trouble with your mother. I know, she's terrible! Relatable. I, think, I, mean, I, I didn't mean to disobey her. I just wanted to go out into the world and learn better healing because mom's like well avari your healing could be better and i'm like i know it could be better but you're not letting me do anything about it so you're a grown-ass adult and uh... <laughs> i am 18 years old i am a fully grown woman uh i will giggle a little bit to that because she like said it but she also knows that like yeah Avari is very naive, even though like Kaya is also naive, but like doesn't think she is. <laughs> so she'll just like tap her on the shoulder and be like, "Oh, it's so cute of you to think that." Pot kettle, yeah. Yep, yeah. yep. Huh? Wonder who that's exactly. for. But it's fine. It's fine. You know what? My uncle was happy to see us, and at the end of the day, he outranks my mom, and he's her older brother, so he definitely outranks her. So like. <laughs> It's, it's all, fine. It comes down to rank. It's all about rank. And she's just gonna do a quick. Um, actually, I'm gonna do a check. Um, would it be vigilance or something else to see if my brothers are spying on us? Oh, uh, vigilance or perception? Well, I'm shit at vigilance. Where's perception? We're gonna do perception. <laughs> <laughs> How many purple? Um, in this case, two. What is Avari doing? Seeing if her brothers are spying on us. And I don't see anything. Um, of course they're not. I've already cased the joint. Mm-hmm. Anyway, like, as long as my uncle likes you, that's really all that matters. I mean, no one else here would ever do anything to defy him. <laughs> um, they wouldn't he's well, the chief I'm waiting for well, the plot twist is there like somewhere I can find a teacher a master or something like that because that's kind of the whole reason my dad I could teach you there. or one of his lieutenants Um, they're really skilled okay yeah, my dad and my uncle are master editors and could... I'm sure they'd be happy to teach you. With that, uh, at the mention of uh, your dad, your uh, dad and mother uh, enter into the tea room oh. and say, Mom, go away! Bring my light. You know, right? Like, let me slam the door. <laughs> Slam the ice of uh, the clock hanging up in the doorway. Mm -hmm. um, Hi, mom and dad. Greetings, daughter, your dad says. I heard uh, tell that you were looking for a master water vendor. For me, I swear, I, I, I don't do any bending that's not healing. Um, my friend Karu would love to, to, to learn. <laughs> yeah, there were um there were no real teachers left in the Southern Water Tribe, so I just kinda had to figure it all out myself. And it is, what is sh was not something oh, I could teach him the actual practical aspects of. Well of course not. We're women. I'm also not a You're not a vendor at all, Asia. I'm also not a water Wait. vendor. 
apply. Yeah, I'm. There's a reason. It's. I'm not lying. I'm. I'm yeah. leaving out one aspect of a truth. Yeah, I love it. I am not I a water it. bender. With that, uh, Karu's not Karu's father. Sorry, Avari's father. Yo, he's here. <laughs> right? <laughs> Surprise! There's no, a poker no. game in the back. Um, Father Ruik um, is uh, the name of the general, uh, Avari's father. Says, I would be happy to teach a southern uh, water vendor the ways of the northern water tribe. I would find it quite beneficial to see uh, what you have been taught. Just give him a nod. A part oh, wow. of me really hopes that I just, like we sparred, I just absolutely destroy him because that'd be really funny. That would be awesome. That would be so great. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you so much for being understanding and welcoming to my friends. It's entirely just... possible that if he did build this guy as an actual NPC, he built him based off of you. <laughs> <laughs> The me that I, had 50 XP sitting in reserve before, like, an hour before session. <laughs> I, I will say that uh, I did build out a sheet for him, and he has 250 earned XP. So oh. he is... So he is about approximately. He, he's he's had a couple of adventures. Yeah. <laughs> um, with that... <laughs> Um, what do you all do? Um, you're kind of absolutely talking to uh, the parents, as it were. Are you going to continue that conversation, explore, work on trade negotiations? I think I'm going to... Is Tarim's sister with us? Uh, at this point, she has uh, now come to the hut and has <laughs> her own tea. I'm going to introduce her to my dad. Greetings. It is a pleasure to meet uh, one who comes from the desert. We we saved her from a really bad marriage, but like in order for her to stay single and ready to mingle, um, we employed her. So she is now our trade emissary and will be handling all communications with the Beifongs. What an important position. And with that... She takes a look at Avari, because if I remember correctly, you gave her the bells. I, I Yeah, I did. So Avari's hair is, like, intricately braided, but there's no bells. And he takes a look. Daughter, where are your bells? I Well, I, I have to say for I, I do, because you say that I'm really good at sneaking up on people and that you need to hear me at all times. But, you know, they're they're worth a lot of money. So I bought out her dowry. Oh, daughter. I choose not to be married to an absolute creep, daddy. No, he's like, may, may the moon shine brightly upon you for your efforts. Oh. Huh. Oh. And meanwhile, you hear your mother mumble something about grandmother's inheritance. Mm -hmm. there is a... Grandma taught me to be independent and to think for myself. Yes, well, you certainly have a mind of your own. That is true, Avari. I do. With that, it's been some time. Um, Kareem and uh, Kaye, you have a racking feeling in your gut. As yeah. if they are on. As if they oh. are on fire. Oh, no. Oh, you got laxative. So I went from, like, being, like, shivering cold to now I'm, like, having, like, hot flashes and I'm, like, taking Gotta clothes poop. off in the snow. <laughs> uh, so this is really hot in here. This is far more than a heart, fl uh, heart flash. You should end up uh, retching and coughing up blood. Oh, no, blood. Oh. 
uh, both of you. So, Kaye, with those three threats, you're going to take three wounds. Cool. And Tarim, you will take one wound. Oh. Uh, that's okay. not good. I didn't sign up for this. Um, so what? I'm sorry, what? What? I... What? This is Afari. This isn't Jenny. Is yeah. the uh, is the server still in the room? Point server has <laughs> uh, left. Um, uh, when Avari's parents entered the room. Ira, go by the server. Bring him here. Uh, mm. Peng, uh, I will as like between wretches and blood. Uh, I will uh, release Pengu from my coat, and I will say, "Find that man." And that's my command. Uh, I am going Let to go. Uh... Because I was sitting next to Kai the moment she starts coughing up blood, I will, uh, will basically, uh, grab her and lay her down on her side as I lift up the back of her shirt and put my hand against it. I'm going to attempt to heal. Yeah, I'm going to try to heal, uh, Tareem. Yep. Um... And I, I know that, like, culture dictates that his form stays covered, but I need to make contact with skin, so... Yeah. Yeah. And I'm um, going to... Real, real quick... I'm going to the... remove his, his face shield. I have to. Yeah. Real quick, Tareem, did you officially make the changes where all the forms are too difficulty? I believe so. Okay. Not all forms too difficulty, uh, just... Uh, I think uh, I I can't. Whatever's in the Dropbox. I'm sorry. Um, hold on. Um, we're so good at playing this game. Also, just uh, for for reference, while you're figuring that out, but uh, Karu's gonna go in search of the server. But before mm -hmm. he leaves, he's going to bend whatever's left of the the tea that the two of them had. Uh, so IA's it. and Tareem's tea into and and like. Uh, put it into one of his water pouches because you know mm -hmm. why not? Why not force feed him the the tea he poisoned? This cannot oh, go. Oh yeah, out. and save some for evidence. I make no promises about that. Just freeze a little bit. You do have four water pouches. Okay. And we're on a glacier. Yep. All right. Heal for oh. Yep. Uh. And then so, I'm going to upgrade the check for energy guiding. Mm -hmm. And increase the difficulty for uh, restoration. Yeah. Come here. Quit digging. And here we go. Come on, Asya. Yeah! Oh! Energy okay. guiding and restoration are effectively the same. Yeah, they, they are. But, you know, just... That two wins? Uh, yeah, but I mean, additionally, if you had taken strain, uh, you'll heal two wounds. Yeah. Uh, if you had taken if you had taken strain, you would have healed. Well, energy guiding's uh special thing is that it heals additional strain equal to discipline. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I guess I'll make a medicine check. Good. And that's how many purple? Uh, to heal with medicine check is going to be five. Five purple? It's a nasty thing that they had. Oh, oh to heal me? There's no. I, um... I, 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 I basically said what I did is I, I'm basically forcing the poison out of her system. With firebending. There's a reason I lifted her shirt up and my hand is against her back rather than... Uh... You know what? No, you're right. Um, the poison was derived through tea. Tea is made with water. Are you going to force it out you're of it? You're going to bend at home? Fuck it. Ben, I'm I'm not ben. letting I I've worked so hard to like mature and develop a relationship with this grump grump. I'm not letting anything happen to him. 
So what do I need to do to just rent the the poison from his body? Uh. You would do that. Oh, you did. You did learn that uh, healing technique back in the library. Oh, that's really complicated. Oh yes, the uh, the the combat healing, the aggressive healing. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, Fuck it. Bye. <laughs> Fuck Are you it. okay? What? You're doing this to me? Yes. Yeah. Oh. Not me, so I'm part of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so how do how do I do this in dice? Uh, I mean, I think I have to take what does it say? Three strain. Uh, two strain for uh two making strain. bending, but that's after the fact, so you don't really need to worry about it at the moment. Um, I mean, I'm still gonna. Did you have notes from that? That I, I have it all copy pasted. Uh, um, should I run this as a medicine check, as a bending art, as a? Well, you're using yeah. bending, aren't you? So yeah. it's definitely yeah. Yeah. bending. Yeah, water, 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 and water bending, bending heal, I believe. Which one? You know what? No, bending yeah. arts is it? Uh, presence, cunning, intelligence, uh, intelligence, intelligence. Intelligence. Yeah. Okay. And she is. I mean, she didn't even care that her mom is here at this point because, like, she's fucking pissed. Like, she... I brought my friends, what and someone the... fucking poisoned them. What were the rules upon that like new technique that you learned? Uh, let me copy paste it, because it's a lot to read out loud. I think it was just straight up blood bending. <laughs> it is. It's just blood it bending. Is. It is blood bending. Yeah. And since it's never been done before, I think we're taking some creative liberties. What's that? Huh? I said there was some consequence to it. I remember, but I don't. Yeah, I. I have to take a lot of strain. And we're not doing it as a damage, we're doing it as a heal. So it shouldn't inflict any wounds on him if I do Unless, okay. Right, yeah. you're Unless just people. you're 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 doing your own thing. You've effectively made a, a form of your own that is I, like blood bending, but it does the opposite. It yes, heals it's stomach bending. Of, stomach bending, right. Right. So I have my bending arts, and what am I doing as far as other other dice? Um, I, I would just assume it's an easy check base, but I would just assume you want to do uh, restoration, which is an increase in difficulty. Okay. Yeah. So that's two purple. And I'm gonna flip a story point. Uh huh. As uh, the nasty poison. And upgrade one of my purples to a red. Yep. Oh god. Okay, oh god. I'm going to flip it back. Wait, no, I already have three no, yellow. I can't do anything to oh, upgrade no, that you further. Would, you, no, you, you would add a green die. It you would add a green. Because yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna flip one back and add a green. Yep. All right. And so I have my bending arts. I have a green. I have two purple, and one of those purple is going to be a red. Yep, that's yep. right. Oh my god. Oh, you're oh healing god. a lot better oh, than Okay, I so so Avari is fucking livid. And she's going to apologize to Tareem and like take the, the face covering off because like he is throwing up and he needs to be able to breathe and she's gonna get him like onto like a hands and knees position. And she's going to like palpate and try to find like where the poison is centered. And she's gonna try to remember back to what she read in that book in the library where she gave that nice owl a band-aid. And she is just going to in like a desperate attempt just like Try to tear the poison away from his bloodstream. 
I guess through his pores. That is what? Fuck. atrocious. Ugh. So I'm gonna say with that threat, um, that you literally tear it out of his pores and his body just uh which was lying on the ground becomes rigid and hard and then uh ends up um, arcing into the air slightly as you rip oh. the poison out. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm gonna do a regular healing check. I'm sorry, I am so sorry. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I can fix this. I can, I can fix this. Um, medicine check. How many purple? Um, I think I'm okay. Yeah, he's okay. It's just narratively, okay. you like really ripped it out of him. So it was a like, okay. deeply unpleasant feeling for to Green. I'm and sorry. You said it also I am lift so off sorry. The ground? Yeah. Oh boy. So it's become apparent to people watching. Mm. Yeah. Um, your mother looks shocked and not in a good way. <laughs> My mom can eat a bag of dicks. <laughs> Kareem, just... what do you do now that you've had this poison ripped out of your body? Uh, you said it was a very unpleasant experience. Yeah, it was very painful. Oh. Uh, roll over, get up, because I'm on the ground. I grab my face covering. I'm sorry. I, 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 I I'm sorry. I, I need Amari's to breathe. Hand, and I, I put it on. I stare at her. I look at the mom. And I say, uh, God, I, I just say, you are a bad parent. And I walk <gasps> out. Damn. Did you just read her mom? I love it. Oh my god! Avari's gonna chase after him. As you leave, you can hear your mother say, Avari, wait! What the heck was that? <laughs> she doesn't answer, she just dashes off after Tareem. I am so sorry. I just you, your your airway was obstructed. I shrug and... her off and I, I push her I push her back. Don't Okay. Are you mad at her? Yeah she ripped off his face covering. But yeah. why is he I mean I would have you're been a flat to the mom and also fuck you for taking off my mask. A lot of emotions. A lot of yeah. emotions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's how's Kaye? I mean, dying. Drinking another cup of tea. You <laughs> <laughs> to recover from this. This is so traumatic. <laughs> we'll never touch tea again. No. But only I, I did roll. I did roll three threats on the check. That's why I was. Oh yeah, I don't know. We didn't use the threats. Yeah, um, because we were waiting for the situation to resolve. So yeah. Yeah. So you're going to uh, take a point of strain and then also take a setback die as you're physically exhausted on your next check. All right. All right. Yeah. Uh, um, oh. Yeah. Oopsie. Up, upon yeah, that. It's uh, the wrong person. Yeah. Azia will uh, hold a hand out to Kai and says, Are oh, you all right? I'll live. <laughs> At which point, uh, sorry, I passed you a uh, a a black by mistake. I mean, no, you pass it to Asia. Yeah, yeah by by mistake, I just forgot. I accidentally did that. Letting them know. Right. Um. Asia will uh. Uh, look over to the Avari's mother and says is. And see her expression says is instead of being shocked that your daughter has learned new techniques, you should be proud that she's expanding her knowledge. And she runs after the she helps Kaye up and sees if she's gonna continue uh if she wants to go after the go after Karu and, and them. Uh well Karu went to low for the is 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 Tareem also going after the... 
I think Tareem left the... If I understand correctly, Tareem is outside, and Karu is inside the palace looking for the the server, right? Yeah, I think. Tareem doesn't really understand what's going on. She, like... She's like, what what happened? You know, like, why why did I have that reaction and no one else did? Or mm-hmm. and me me and Kareem and no and you guys didn't. We all drank the tea. I believe that it was in the cups rather than the tea itself. Why would someone and... do something like that? What did we do? Avari's gonna just walk back in and sit down quietly. Have they found him? Well, back to Karu. Back to Karu. (laughs) (laughs) Back to Karu. Karu, uh, make your survival check to try to track um, his steps in the snow. Uh, Could I argue for vigilance instead? (laughs) You can argue for it, but it will be more difficult. How much more difficult? <laughs> It'll be three purple Please. instead of two. Yeah, I'll take that gladly. <laughs> and I'll uh, I'll flip. Um, nice is Pengu things. helping me here? What? I did. Oh, yeah, I, I commanded him. He's oh, there. Yeah. He's there with Karu. Okay, so yeah, he would do. Yeah, that. that's true. So then another boost. I heard about it. Pengu put some like uh, water tribe war paint on. He's like, oh let's do this. God. Water tribe. Jeez, <laughs> oh, those blues said no. Oh what, about, what about my knowledge seeker? I have that, don't I? I think. I don't remember. I, I have animal companion that I don't remember why. It's the it's the fox thing. We all want it. The fox thing. Yeah, no, I, I don't remember if I have a knowledge seeker. If I just bought the talent to get something else, I don't remember. No, you, you bought the talent to have the fox. All right, get the fox yeah. help me. The fox will give you one boost die. Oh, great. Another blank. Here it is. Hey, 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 hey. hey, hey. Mm. That's what we needed. So you're definitely going to be able to track him down, but what would you like to do with those advantages? Crack him down quickly. All right, you catch him just as he's about to go Real into quick. a into a boat down one of the canals. You thought? I'm going to use water bending, and I'm going to raise the ice area in front of him to create a slide and force him to go backward. All right. Feel free to make your roll. Uh, what bending arts? Uh, cunning, I think, in this case. Yeah, that makes sense. For construct. What difficulty? An average. Of course. Damn, Daniel. Why? Wow. My luck's just not great. You did generate two advantages, though, so what would you like to do with those advantages? He turns it into he turns the the snow in front of him to ice actually. Don't forget to um, I'm going to use our last point real quick. Uh and do elementalist to get four more advantage. <laughs> and then I'm going to use Warrior of the Elements to immediately do an attack as a maneuver. Mm-hmm. Oh right. And I'm going to aim. Uh, with true All right. Uh, you will um, upgrade this once because he has adversary one. Uh, how far and away is he? He is at medium distance from you. Perfect. All righty. Um, and he also has defensive one. So upgrade it once and then add a black. Oh, no. damn. Just no. Just no, he's not allowed to live. Well, you you you, you still have what I had the upgrade from the adversary. Yes, I know. That's why there's a purple. Yeah. I, 
the the upgrade that, uh, comes you... before any reduction, so it's gonna be a red, not a purple. Whoa! Look at that! Look at that fucking roll! Dang! Oh. I have one less advantage. Yeah. Um. <laughs> so yeah, oh. I will. I don't. I I I don't know if I really need to do anything else. I could just hit him another time, and I think he's down. Because <laughs> that's fourteen. Just drag him back. Five. Um, are you trying to kill him, him, or are you trying to knock him out? Knock him out. Yeah, you can um, hit him with stun. Yeah, I can do that. Um, yeah. So, I'm hitting him with this. It's it's uh, it's stun damage, and then I activate stun for another 5 uh, strain, so that's a total of 19. Then I hit again for another 14 pierce 5. Then I activate stun again for another uh, making it 19 twice, which is 38 strain damage. Jesus Christ! <laughs> What's the... what? Yeah, yeah, no. Car Karu is really good at just knocking people the fuck out, or <laughs> killing them. I can also do that. I'm just saying, <laughs> I, I I don't think you have enough strain to keep you alive. Can you kill with stun damage? I feel like no, with not in not twice, in Genesis, not in Genesis. No, but I if I just did this as strain, he would probably be dead. Right. Or if I just did this um, as wounds, would, he would probably be dead. Not probably. He would be like completely eviscerated. Yeah. <laughs> um. All right. So he is knocked out. Describe what that looks like. So Karu, uh, begin because this this form is ice. So he's about to start launching all these like icicle things at at this dude after he kind of fails to force him to, to move backward. Um, and then instead of, but instead of uh, launching sharp ice, he just kind of rips up blocks and throws them at him. Kind of, it looks less like water bending and more like earth bending, considering that's the bending he's seen the most of. And he's just chucking giant hunks of ice and just smacking him with them until he goes down and is unconscious. Have some passerby who are walking by and see a southern water tribe member attacking northern tribe water member, and they start rushing up to you saying, Hey, what are you doing? Uh, uh he poisoned my friends, I think. <laughs> <laughs> um, make a charm check. Fuck. You're gonna get a boost because you are from the southern water tribe. What difficulty? I want to flip a story point. Oh, so that, it'll, be, uh... <laughs> it'll be hard, so two purple, one red. Yep. Oof. Oof. Oh, <laughs> so close. So with it, they uh, surround you and they pull out their spears and they say, you're coming with us. Can you at least bring him to? Certainly, we have but, questions for him as well. I I didn't do anything wrong. Why, huh? From our pers from their perspective, you basically just attached an open water tribe member. I know that was in character. Oh, okay. And they're like, if what you say is true, then we will free you. From from my perspective, the Jedi are evil. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, gotta get that Star Wars reference in. Does Karu go along with this is the question. I mean, they're probably just gonna bring him before Avari's dad anyway. Yeah, so, like, but... if anything, they're gonna lead him back to where he was going. But would he want to be captured? <laughs> now, here's the question. Do they have any real way of restraining waterbenders in the Northern Water Tribe? Not easily, no. Given the nature of water being everywhere, and the nature you of know, the entire just dropped her name. Of water. They've got to have a way. Like there's, they, I, well, like how else would they? The I mean, water tribe maybe just in the. They can. They can. They can. Um. Let's see here. I'm trying to think of the best way. 
<laughs> yes, sir, they... don't use your water bending and come with us. <laughs> I'm just sorry. So yes, they they do. Um, uh, they use the oasis. Oh, uh, in that grassy area, there's a cave. I'm saying that there's a cave there now. Uh, that is a, a away yeah. from water, which also means for Kaya, there's Earth. All right, I I have decided I will not escape the law. I will I will go with them. <laughs> now, stop! You have broken the law. You will pay for your crimes against the people of Skyrim. Taking the you... stop! You have violated the law. Pay the court a fine or serve your sentence. Fine. Pay with your blood. Oblivion do did it the uh, best. Yeah, and it's Oblivion also super it jank. Best. Yeah, it is super janky because the lines were alphabetized. <laughs> so you were? were? Right, anyway. This is a little too anyway. off topic. I, I love a good uh, Elder Scrolls reference. Um, with that, you are taken to um, the Northern Water Tribe Oasis, uh, where you feel a sense of calm and serenity around you. And you were brought back to a cave um, that has bars at the very back of it. You are surrounded by darkness and can no longer feel the presence of the moon. With that, we're going to return to the rest of the party. Time for the eye oh, workout oh. scene. Push it to the limit. Oh, yeah. Except for. Um, oh. One of the guards who captured uh, Karu ends up going back to the rest of the party and says, General, there's been an attack by one of the outsiders. What? The general looks at him um, and says, what happened? He's like, he attacked your servant boy. Good. And with that, they everyone just turns and looks at Avari. Bring him here. Mm -hmm. My friend and the servant. Now. They pause because you're basically now. and they look at your father and your father says do as she says. Mm -hmm. And with it we'll have a little bit of a time skip and you are now back in the throne room of the Northern Water Tribe. Oh, we're in the throne room now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh shit. With your uncle uh, presiding over uh, the events as Karu comes in fettered in chains. And with it, um, sitting with a bandage to his head, uh, laying uh, down in front of the of your uncle is the uh, server. Your uncle says, what is the meaning of this? An attack upon one of my own. Um, Azia will. Step Thank forward. you. I did not want to have to make this worse for you all. <laughs> Azia will step forward and say, "Is this servant boy is responsible for poisoning my compatriot?" And uh, she will. Uh... God damn it! Why do you have four water skins? What do you mean, uh, why do I have four water skins? We were in the desert! Have, yeah. <laughs> uh, Azia will uh, pull uh, the one of the water skins off Karu. That had the tea in it, yeah. Yeah, that had the tea in it. That she, her, with her high vigilance, she would have noticed passively. And say is, this water skin contains the tea that was brewed from the cups that my friends drank from and were subsequently poisoned by. I do not know um, why he would do such a thing. With that, um, actually, uh, Avari's mother comes up and looks over at the team, sniffs it, and she says that she takes a sniff 
and her eyes roll back for a second. Don't worry, mother's not getting poisoned. Um, I mean, she could, it's fine. Uh, Jinx. <laughs> Uh, her, her eyes roll back and she says this tea is in fact poison. I believe it is from the green lotus. The whomst? The green lotus. It is a vile plant. Someone had it out for two of the people who were responsible for my safety when I was out in the world. Am I understanding this correctly? And she's going to just like shoot her questions directly at the servant. And he says, it is not for me to say, I will say nothing to- They are my retinue. Retinue. And you deign to take them away from me. Whoa. You know what? Uh, Azia will put a hand on Avari and says this. You should not be seen being forceful with your own people. As she steps forward towards him. Now smack him, Asya. Just smack him in the yeah. face. <laughs> um, Asya will... Uh, no, I won't. Will basically grab him by the collar, hold her hand up, and she, I'm gonna do something cheeky. Wait, no, Asia. Uh, Mommy, hello. I, I, I need Mama Asia to be okay. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to um, hug my augment myself real quick. Okay. With fire. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be straight fire instead of lightning. Oh no. This in the oh. Northern Water Tribe is not going to go well for you, but no, it's keep not. Going. But uh, oh my god, oh, oh my god, why? She's proving a point. Okay, okay, I'm all right. never gonna have friends over again. Okay, uh, you brought a fucking water firebender here. You brought a firebender to our home. Yep. Uh, here we go. There we go. Yep, I got it. So. I'm just going to, uh, as, and it's just basic augment, so what happens is she, her, basically her hand becomes coated in fire as she punches the, uh, ground next to him, melting the ice, and say, if you will not tell me why you poison my compatriots, then the Fire Nation's wrath is the last thing you will ever have to worry about. With that, as the scene of you punching the ground with your fists wreathed in fire, um, the chieftain's eyes narrow and shout, you brought a firebender here? Oh, and... fuck you, Evan. <laughs> now, I was going to say that anyway. Evan just beat me to the punch. Sorry. Um, <laughs> and for context, there's about 30 guards between waterbenders and um, those who also have spears and uh, shields as well, they all instantly go into a combat sense and um, be, some of them surround the chieftain while the others um, begin approaching Asia. He is of the water tribe. Yeah, she is. She is from the southern water tribe. She is wearing wolf armor at the moment with that has half of it bur burned away from the lava. Uh, she, she so I have, a, I have a question, uh, Ibisal. Yeah. So I'm in chains, correct? Mm -hmm. Correct. But I can still bend. With great difficulty. Um, so I'm not actually like triggering a thing, but Karu is gonna like stomp it, his his foot and like get into kind of a stance as the the chains jangle and a bunch oh. of little shards of ice are gonna start floating up and he's just gonna look at the the people approaching Asia and say, "Do not get any closer." Make a coercion check. Alrighty. Oh boy! Oh boy! You guys, what is happening? <laughs> and I'm gonna flip a story point for this. Alrighty. Uh, it's three purple, one red. Oh. 
Mm. Um, can I argue for maybe some boost or something? Because I am bending regardless of the chains, and I'm kind and of spooky. Also, it's like spam and like I'm your last name is family. Yeah, and, so, and like, if yeah. I vouched for her, that should count towards your benefit. You'll get two boost die on this. Good. I'll take it. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, Art is kind of intimidating. <laughs> He's All either right. awkward or badass, oh, and there isn't one between. It's what? perfect. So what would you like to do with those two advantages? Um, you definitely succeed in having them um, stop advancing. Um, maybe get them to kind of like stand down a bit, like back off some more. Yeah, they'll back up a little bit. Um, their eyes wide in fear at the power of this bender who's bending despite being shackled. Yeah, at which point Asya will, without letting go of the man, as she just kind of lifts him up because strong, strong Asya, uh, mm-hmm. she holds her hand up and says, this, "Yes, I am a firebender, but I was born in the Southern Water Tribe. My father hailed from the Fire Nation before the Great War started." And he met my mother there. My sister was a waterbender of the southern tribe. And Karu's mother. You may see me as a firebender and enemy. But believe me, there is no one in this room that has more hatred for the Fire Nation than I do. More vitriol towards their practices. Fire is not meant to be a weapon of war. Or tool for intimidation. But it can be used as such. And I... Only charm check and... Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, what is the charm Give yourself two boost die for the good role-playing. Okay. Amazing. What's the difficulty? Um, it's going to be... I'm going to flip another story point. One red, two purple. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, here we go. Thank God. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. All right, so you succeed. I like what? how the only thing that passed, that made me pass that, was my base presence. Yes. Nothing else helped. All right. Works, so, it works. <laughs> yeah, it works, it works. Also, I should have two more turns. Okay. All right, so you succeed in talking to the chieftain, and he says, stand down. Stand down. Guy's mad. And with it, all falls silent in the room as the eyes turn to the server. Except the crackling of the fire. Yes. And and then there's just like breaking ice sounds as the little things fall to the ground. <laughs> yep. Azia looks back towards the server and says. You will tell me what your purpose is. I do not wish to harm you, but if you make it necessary, like the spirits of the water, I will not hesitate. And then he looks at you and says, I would rather die than betray my kind. At which point, Asya will uh, hold her arm, hold her hand up, and move to strike, but at the last second, just put her hand on him and do heal. Oh! Oh! 
All right, make your heal check. I'm going to cry. All right. Uh, I get an extra green on this. I'm going to empower it. Uh, and then I'm going to do energy guiding. All right. Uh, there we go. What? Bam. How? So many advantages. So many okay, advantages. Nice. Up, let me let me see if I got anything that I can try again for that. Wait, would you get a boost because you've seen Hotfoot's work before? I would give him a boost. Well, yeah. That that w wouldn't help. I'm just trying to see because sadly we're in the North Pole, so I don't get anything. <laughs> but there's literally a fire going right now, so you could pull energy from that. Oh, you are well. That that that's my augment. That's that's why I have an extra green on there. And it's daytime. Yeah. It's just daytime. I don't think thematically speaking, it the being sun's out. Day. Well, yeah, as per usual. But anyway, I quit. Uh, you know what? I'm just you rise with the moon. I I'm rise just, with the sun. I'm just gonna attempt it again, real quick. Okay. All right. And just pass myself three boosts. Uh, that's a smart. lot of boosts. What the Why? fuck? What the yeah. final law? Yeah. Wow. We'll, we'll, we'll wow. See. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Eventually it'll work. What yeah. are you doing? You just rolling? What? I'm just. Yeah, I, 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 I just, the Yeah, I just I was just rolling because what the fuck? There's like the chances of me failing that twice in a row is ridiculous. So the chance of me <sighs> barely passing is even lower. But oh well. But yeah, so the fire doesn't harm him. It's just warm against his skin, as she says is. You betray your people by acting like this to their friends. Make a charm check with two boosts. Let's see. Uh, difficulty? Uh, three purple. No upgrades. I'm not going to upgrade because this is funny. What? Oh my god. The Of course, now you succeed. <laughs> oh my god. Uh... And with that, his eyes linger and gaze forward looking around himself. And looks at um, Avari's brothers. Um, fuck them. And with that, he says them. And we'll end the session there. Uh, the brothers did this? What? <laughs> I believe it. All right. With that, we will call it here for today. As always. Please have a good morning, good afternoon, and good evening wherever you are, and please stay frosty. If you are watching this on YouTube, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And until next time.